another Raydon haul of mine. If this is your first one, hi, welcome. Um, I put out Raydon videos a ton, um, but I feel like it's starting to kind of like die down a little bit, so I don't know how much more I'm going to be buying. I don't know. We'll see. So yeah, I do have a small little haul to share with you. A ton of canisters, honestly. Didn't didn't expect that. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to hop right into this video. If you're new here, please don't forget to go below and click that subscribe button. If you do like this video, please hit that like button and let's just get right into the haul, guys. So it's going to be a pretty quick haul and I'm just going to show you guys a couple of things that isn't Ray Dunn, but I'm going to incorporate in my Ray Dunn displays. And it is these three um, spatulas, and they're all like Easter themed. They got little bunnies. They actually, I was holding these, they actually came with cookie cutters, and each one was like $3.99 each, so I didn't think it was a bad deal. Cookie cutters came with an egg, a bunny, and a butterfly. Um, but yeah, these are the spatulas. They are super, super cute. They all have bunnies on them, and I just think that they're going to be super cute with a little baking display. Um, it's just kind of something that I want to start doing with my displays, so I wanted to get something, um, what's the word? Seasonal? I wanted to get something seasonal to display with them, so I de decided to get these. The next thing you probably just saw that I got is this Ray Dunn bunny love blanket it is super super cute super soft this is another thing that i want to start buying for my collections it's actually really inexpensive it was only $16.99 which i thought was amazing usually like their blankets not really done but like blankets at home goods are $24.99 something like that but this is super cute it's going to be for display um on my little bench i want to start putting a, a blanket there um, but yeah, I saw this and I absolutely love the purple. I think it's so, so cute. So I wanted to get this. The next thing that I did not find, Connor found, he found these and it is the yellow, um, measuring cups. There was like four in our store one morning. We, I overlooked it. Another girl overlooked it and Connor found them and I was like, oh yes. So I got the yellow ones. I'm really trying to find the blue because you guys know my obsession with blue, but at this point I think that I miss them, um, which is really, really sad. I'm, I don't know. I really want the blue so bad, but I'm still happy to have gotten a um, spring color for a display, so I'm super, super happy that I got these. All right, this is going by quick just because there's not much to show. I only got one mug, but this mug is everything, and it is the green bunny kisses mug, you guys. I'm so, so excited about this. This is so freaking pretty. This was like my unicorn for the um, the season. This was the one that came with the candy, so I did spend the $12.99, but I don't even care. To me, it was like 100% worth it. I love this mug so much. The green is really, really starting to like catch my eye and I'm actually really starting to love it. So I really am so happy that I got this mug. So I'm going to jump into the canisters and then I have one last separate thing that I'm going to show you guys. So the first one that I'm going to show is, let's do this one. It's the brown sugar canister. My friend got this for me. Um, I actually technically had this like three weeks ago, but I wasn't able to haul it because I didn't physically have it to share with you guys. But yes, I have the brown sugar, so this basically completes my set for my pantry. So I think I'm going to do like an organizational like pantry redone video. So if you're interested in that, comment below. Um, it's just something that I think would be really cute, especially in the pantry. So I'm glad to got this. Um, not a big baker, but I guess... I'm gonna need brown sugar in my pants right now. All right, so we're gonna go into my four, four Easter canisters. I hauled the skinny egg hunt, but I, this is what this was the egg hunt that I purchased from CaliforniaEnglish.com. Some of you guys were asking me about that. I will link it in the description bar below. Um, but I like this one so much better, so I ended up selling the egg hunt to just a local. Um, this one is so much cuter. It's like the medium size, and it's like the same size as Peep. Um, so I think that's just going to be perfect for display purposes, and I just like the way that the egg hunt looks on this. So cute. Um, if you don't know what California English is, it's a website where they do sell Ray Dunn. 
but it's kind of tricky because a lot of the times you'll go on the website and things are sold out so you kind of have to just be on the website at the right time when things are loaded um honestly i just i'm not really good with that website but my friend joanne um I've posted about her Instagram all over my, my uh, YouTube channel before. She had mentioned that they were online, so I went on and I was actually able to buy it. So I'm just putting out that disclaimer. So if you do try go going on to like California English, it's kind of difficult to buy from there, just because it set like it shows like what's for sale. But when you actually go to click on it, it says it's not for sale. So. I do want to tell you guys that website can be tricky, but if you are able to order from them, I, I like it. But I do have to say that the shipping did take a very long time. Like their processing took a while. And then FedEx, they ship through FedEx, and FedEx is not like the fastest by any means. But uh, it maybe took me three weeks to get this canister. But I don't know. Just wanted to give you guys that heads up if you guys try and order from California English, but I still love the canister nonetheless. And the next canister that I got is Easter candy. I think that is adorable. Um, wasn't like on my major ISO, but I'm still happy to have gotten it. Super cute. I don't know what I'm going to do with all these canisters. I feel like last year there was nothing compared to this year, and now this year it's just like in your face everywhere. Okay, so the next two canisters I did purchase from Mercari. I got a deal. I don't know. It was two for like 70 bucks. So to me, that wasn't a bad deal considering how sought after one of them is now. So we'll just, we'll just show you guys. So the first one is the green chubby jelly beans. Um, it's a matte green, still super cute. Um, I actually just sold my large jelly beans. So now I just have baby and now I have this one. Um, at first I didn't want it, but I, I'm really starting to like the green. I just love all the pastels this year, guys. I, they're just, my heart is just absolutely falling in love with them. So I wanted to get this. And then the next one is the yellow Pete Pete canister. This one is cute, I want to say. I don't know, I'm not a huge fan of the, the matte yellow, but I still really, really like the canister. I want one that said Pete Peep, so. Um, I just thought that it was a decent deal to get both of them because it saved on shipping. So when I saw this, I was like, yes, I actually think I bid it on it and I got it for a little bit cheaper. So yeah, I got these both from Mercari and I did not think it was a bad deal. So my last and final item, I feel bad for sharing this, but I want to share it with you because this is something that I ordered from online and I've just seen everybody having issues with theirs. And I think I'm just one of the lucky few that got one that's just not bad. And it is the Pink Nest Birdhouse. Um, mine is not flawed really in any way. And I feel terrible to like, I want to say brag or glow about it, but I did get lucky. I don't have any like um, paint smears and it's not like, I mean, there's like a couple of like, like paint bubbles like in the back but like they're minor you can barely even see um there's like some like i don't know uh what's the like texture on the back but to be honest it's on the back so i really don't care um the front is pretty much the most important part to me um and i just think that i got really blessed with this order because i've seen people order like five or six and they get like one pink and five five black home birdhouses so I just feel bad um the fact that so many people have been having issues with ordering this birdhouse not getting what they order and what they're getting is just not to the top quality uh, like I said I got really really lucky and I am very thankful that I was able to get first of all get one and second of all get one that's really not in bad condition at all um, if you're able to get your hands on this though it's so pretty the pink that I got because apparently there's different pinks too I loved it. Um, it looks just like the um, pink mugs that were for Valentine's Day. So again, I feel bad for sharing this um, because I know a lot of people have been having issues with the order from TJ Maxx, but um, I did want to share it because I sh already shared it on my Instagram and I just wanted to share it in this haul as well. All right, guys, so that's everything that I got. It wasn't huge by any means like the past couple of hauls that I've had, but I still feel like it was 
decent quality <laughs> worth of haul. So I really hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that like button. Um, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I put up a ton of like done type videos uh, as well as cleaning videos and just like random uh, vlogs and stuff that I do on my daily. So I really hope that you um, consider subscribing to my channel. I would really, really love for you to be a part of my YouTube family. But other than that, I'm just going to go. I hope you guys have a great day and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.